KZWA. Welcome back to the Daily Dose. What's going on? It's Latone. And TC. And this is KZWA's daily podcast where we feature trending topics, pop culture stories, and clickable moments. TC, what we got today? Today is Skyscraper Day. Oh, all you tall people in those buildings, <laughs> all you six foot five and over people that have to duck down to come into the building, it is your day. All the people that helped me in Walmart to reach all the stuff on the high aisles. Yep. Thank y'all so much. I appreciate y'all. And where we're at, there are no skyscrapers, no buildings. Buildings are more than like forty stories high. The every, Chase Building is the highest building. We have. Every time I look around, I think if Spider Man comes here, he got to take a taxi. No, literally, there's like, nothing for him to swing off of. Can't even. T- <laughs> <laughs> he gonna be hitting fire hydrants, man. I can't even get around. <laughs> skyscraper, where ain't no how skyscrapers many, here. How many skyscrapers you've been on? In or on? Like in. I don't. I'm not like on top of or in. Well, I got a lot of family in New York and New Jersey. And so I've been on top. I would say at least 20 or 30. Really? Yeah, people go on the rooftop and act crazy. I'm afraid of heights. So like I try to like stay on. No, nah, once you're up there, like in New York and stuff, the buildings are so close. It's not like you're on a skyscraper and it's open air. It's like another building sitting right yeah. next. You can just jump to the rooftop of the next building. No, nah, I'm good. Plus, it goes down up there. There's a lot of hanky-panky on the roof. The roof is on fire. We don't need no water. Let the... <laughs> I'm going to tell you why they're burning because they're not using no... Protection up there. Ew. It's wild on the roof, man. You see some crazy stuff. Hey, it's sexy up there. <laughs> Ew. Oh, it is. So happy birthday <laughs> to Charlie Sheen. He happy birthday. 50. Aren't you a vampire or crazy? He's only fifty. Yep. Man, that man has lived a long life. I thought he was like fifty-four or fifty-three. That's just three, four years older. I thought he was on his way to sixty. Oh. Mm-mm. Charlie He's Sheen 50. is nuts. I thought thought he was much older than that. Speaking of age. A new survey came out. What is the average age that a person really officially feels like an adult? Now, a lot of people want to say 18, but that's not the age people feel like an adult. Okay, so that's the age that you're legally an adult. Mm-hmm. But what do you think the age, according to people surveyed, what's the age people start feeling like a real adult? 30. You're really close. What? It's 29. 29? 29. When oh, I'm you- doing good. Tria. When you start buying a new house, you get married, you have kids, that's the average age, 29. Like, they're saying adolescence actually lasts until about 24 or 25 now. Well, see, I thought younger because people are having kids so young that it's like... Yeah, but their mom is still paying for them and changing the <laughs> diapers and stuff. Watch my baby while I go yeah, out to the club yeah, tonight. <laughs> got all these 25-year-old grandmamas. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> is that your baby? No, that's my granddaughter. Dang. Where's your Where's your daughter? Is she in the club? Uh, Where'd you start? Oh, he's in the club. You know what? I'm not so, dealing with you. So, but 29 is where the age where people start feeling like an actual adult, independent, on their own, with without the safety net of their parents to pay their bills and whatnot. Gas I cards feel, and all that type of stuff. I feel like you're throwing a slang right now, <laughs> and it's bothering me. You know, moms and dads don't pay the gas card anymore around 29. I told you there was Get a ready. reason. Get ready. That was a reason. Get ready, that. TC. Okay, in Kentucky, a clerk was sent to jail. Good. What? You didn't what? know why. Let me tell you why. Anytime someone goes to jail, good. Okay, well, the clerk refuses to issue a gay marriage license. So. But he should go to jail. Exactly. Because what gay people. She? Oh, she? Yes. Yeah, gay people have the right to be miserable, too. They should be able to be married. <laughs> and you're, Amen. Go to jail, clerk. Go to jail, clerk. Go to jail. <laughs> yeah, she's right in jail now. Married, the gay people have the right to be intimidated emotionally like the rest of the married people in the Stuck world. Stuck inside. Isolated. <laughs> no friends. <laughs> Who is that girl? Why are you looking at that girl? Gay people have that right. <laughs> Share everything. Straight people do not have to be the only miserable people in the world. <laughs> and good, she's going to jail. You know what? I can't stand you. What you got for me, Latoya? Are you pancakes, <laughs> waffles, or French toast? I'm pancakes. All right, because they're saying those are basically the Beyonce of breakfast foods. Kelly Rowland is kind of like the bacon. You would like a little bacon. Yeah, I'd but like a lot of bacon. Your pancakes. Yeah. I'm French toast. Why are you French toast? I think French toast is like kind of exotic. It's not like, it's kind of like almost a. almost bland. It's kind of like a pancake, but it's a little more special. You get a little white powder on it. If you put berries on it, I like it. Berries and cream. Berries and cream. So really, your pancakes over waffles. Yeah. Why pancakes over waffles? Pancakes are just like. Thicker, they're richer than waffles. Oh, so waffles. you're about the thickness. <laughs> you're about that thick. No, okay. I just feel like so, a waffle just. See, rank them. Rank them one, two, and three. Pancake. 
Where, It'd be pancakes, French toast, then waffles. I'm gonna go French toast because it's like a it's like a sexier pancake. No. Waffle because it's kind of crunchy and I like a little crunch. Plus it holds your syrup in the little pockets. I like that. Pancakes are last. It's like boring. They're boring. Like, oh, Have so you boring. ever tried red velvet pancakes? I don't like red velvet anything. <gasps> Okay, the podcast is over. You can no, it's like, not over. Make here. sure you check us out on Twitter, <laughs> Facebook, Tumblr, KZWA1049. And speaking of social media, what's wrong with Ja Rule? He's mad at Wikipedia talking about they're calling him short. They're calling... Isn't he short? He's 5'9", but he's mad that Wikipedia said he's only 5'6". <laughs> he's like, Wikipedia be lying. They say Carly Red is like 37, and she's definitely 50. Carly Red is 30 sexy. I don't care what you she's say. She's 50. Carly Red can get 50 minutes of my time, and she can get the 50 she cent in stop, my pocket right now. She needs to stop trying to be young. No, You're she old, don't. Baby. Just she, take that lick. I'll take that old booty down to the river. You know Yo, Ja Rule's really mad, though. He went on Twitter and said, Wikipedia is the most inaccurate baby stuff ever. Baby. Why do they still in business? Why do they still in business? I don't think they should be around. <laughs> they shouldn't be in the business. I'm 5759. <laughs> <laughs> so Ja Rule is mad, man. Yo, check us out on Facebook, on Twitter. And yo, we got a big, big announcement coming up next week on KZWA. So listen online. Check us out, y'all. Everywhere. KZWAFM.com. Make sure you listen, baby. <laughs>